it's been said that I have a hoarding problem. Some of the things that I like to hoard are dishes. This is one of my stacks of papers. This is from high school. Eventually, if she doesn't get rid of a lot of this junk, it's gonna be a problem. We decided to send Dorothy, the organizer, into Jessica's home to help her get rid of her never-ending hoard. Jessica! Hi. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. This is a lot worse than I expected. We're gonna bring everything out. We have trucks waiting to take it away. Are you okay, babe? I kinda don't wanna do it anymore. <laughs> Jessica has had a lot of trouble letting things go. It's my stuff. I haven't even had the opportunity to look at that. You are going to have to make some decisions to let some I'm... things go. We've got two hours to just get everything spick and span and made over. We have some things to show you. One, two, three. Oh my All right. gosh. <laughs> wow. wow. Coming into here and just seeing the space that we have, just, it's just relieving. I want to bring into the conversation psychotherapist and addiction specialist, Dr. Mike Dow. Jessica, I'd like to offer you 10 free sessions with me. Uh, I'm going to walk you through a very clinically effective treatment. 80% of patients who complete this program say that when they're done, they are very much improved. <laughs> I would love that. That would be great. Thank you. And back with us, Jessica, along with Dorothy, the organizer and psychotherapist, Dr. Mike Dow. Jessica. <laughs> How have you been? I have been great. I love really hearing great. that. I had heard through the grapevine <laughs> that you've been doing great. So have you, have you stopped hoarding? Yes, I have. And I continue, I'm continuing to clean out. So uh, clearly, Dorothy, you've, you, this has been a work in progress. Yep. You're continuing to work with Jessica. What kinds of things? We needed to get the bill straight. We needed to clear more of the stuff. And I thought she needed to get a higher paying job so she could overall just lift her life. And by golly, it's been happening. It Talk. happened. All of it did. So yeah. new job? Achieved. What else? Um, we, I did have to move, so we did get a different place, and um, that is remaining clean, so yay for that. And I got this for Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> and of course, Manny is here, and, and Dr. Dow, I know you worked with Jessica. What's the biggest change you've noticed? I think her optimism. You know, Jessica, I'm so proud of you. When I first met you, it felt like there was so much wrong in your life. And, and now when I talk to you over the course of our sessions, the way you've done so much work with Dorothy, so much work on yourself, you did the work. And what I see now is this optimistic woman who looks at the what's right in her life, motivated by your faith, by your recovery, and, and it's incredible. I mean, not only, uh, when I look at the transformation of your room, I feel like there's just as much transformation inside you, and, and I just couldn't yeah. be more proud of you. <laughs> and Jessica, before we go, I wanna give you the floor. Do you have a tip for anyone out there watching who may be a hoarder, who may be dominating their life? The number one thing that I learned, which uh, helped me have achievable goals with Dorothy, is just setting a timer. Instead of looking at everything going, oh my God, it's unachievable, I, I don't even know where to start. It's like, just set a 10 minute, 15 minute timer and just start somewhere. And in doing that and utilizing that tool alone, I emptied five tubs of paperwork that I have been moving and <laughs> holding on to for a long time and about four boxes of clothes that I just donated to Goodwill. Hey, Rome, Rome wasn't built in a day, and right? this is a process. We're so happy for you, Jessica. Dorothy, thank you. Thank you. And, Good job. And best of luck <laughs> to the two of you in your, in your you wedding. So we'll be right back, everyone.